Hello guys, my name is Jana and I'm in the beautiful Rudopi mountain and in this video I'd like to show you something very very special. This is the fleece, they call Halishte here, Halishte. Actually it's a kind of a woolen blanket made of real sheep wool of course. I'm in the beautiful village of Verbovo and I wanted to show you something that's very very typical of the Rudopi mountain. The word Halishte actually connects, links, connect, uh, is related to the Bulgarian word Hala which means blizzard, storm, a winter storm, a blizzard. Hala, um, or something very, very powerful, and then all oh, the elements even, and this is Halište, made of, always handmade, of course. Now, uh, the Rudopi Mountains are a very, very special place. This is the only place in Bulgaria you can have where you can find combination of plaid and bagpipe music, okay? They're very, very famous for their fabulous food, fabulous music, fabulous customs and traditions, long history, and the lovely, lovely, wonderfully hospitable and fabulous people. Now, I wanted to, I wanted to show you a little, just to give you a little sampling of the Rudopi Mountains. I'm here at 1600 meters. Actually, you can see houses down there. These are the former municipal buildings, okay, and the library and the, uh, the cultural center of the village of Verbovo. Now the village is unfortunately empty. All these houses around are empty because there is only one registered person here and uh, officially registered and only one permanent uh, resident uh, in the village. Uh, it's absolutely fabulous. I hope you enjoyed this video and maybe sometimes you visit the fabulous, fabulous Rodopi Mountain somewhere near here is the uh, uh, Pamparovo, um, is the Pamparovo Skiing Resort. Uh, if you're a skier, you'll be interested in that. You might be interested in that. And uh, also uh, the Rodopi Mountains actually are the home um, of Orpheus, the mythical Orpheus. Uh, in another video, I uh, s said that already, but I'll repeat it. The name of the Rodopi Mountain actually uh, links to two mythical figures in Greek mythology. The queen, a Thracian queen who was turned into a mountain by the gods because she was naughty. Uh, and haughty, <laughs> rather she was haughty, vain and haughty, maybe she was naughty, I don't know, okay, sorry. Uh, and uh, um, another, another mythical figure whose name was Rodopi in the uh, Greek mythology was actually a nymph. So a Thracian queen who was turned into a mountain because, uh, because she was haughty, vain, haughty and a nymph. Um, as I said, the, the place is absolutely fantastic. Their food is unforgettable. Their music is uh, actually the echo, the Rudopian echo. They have their music, their songs uh, remind you of the echo because you stand for, on one ridge of the mountain and you shout uh, to the other ridge of the mountain where maybe is your uh, love. Okay, or at least this is the legend. So the Rudopi music is long and slow and, and sometimes very sad and it just hits you in the car. The base is some thread, right? Okay. So this is a very, very typical Rodopi thing called Khalište. Okay. Da. Sheep, wool. Prejda, ne prejda, volna, volna. Volna od ovca od gore. I se pravi na stan. On the loom, actually. And this is called Khalište, um, Khalište. Uh, Marianne is from Rodopi Mountain, okay, yeah. nicknamed Murata, which means actually a uh, local, what, fir tree, Marianne, okay, and she knows about these things. Beautiful. Haliste. Haliste, yeah. Beautiful.
Благодаря. Да, it's very difficult to make one like that. Трудно се правят. Колко време иска за едно? Not един месец. Not един месец. You need more than a month for this one. Халище. And of course it's beautiful to put. It's very soft as well. It's beautiful to put on a bench, for example. Yeah, exactly. Много красиво нещо. Много топло. Те се ги използвали да се завиват с тях. They used them. Не, не, за така за сядане, супер и за завиване. But they used to use them for cover, I mean to cover themselves in the winter. Те се ги използвали за завивка едно време също. Предполагам. Не, да, не, то родовското дяло е за завивка, това е за отдолу. А родовското дяло е за завивка, това е за отдолу да сядаш и да бягаш отгоре. А, окей. Но е тежко за завивка. Защото е тежко за завивка. Виж, като друго е от извора да черпиш. Окей, благодаря ти много, страхотно.